the journal that I've made and this journal is a shabby chic style junk journal turned out quite chunky um, got a little bit of a problem trying to keep them flat <laughs> so the journal is made with a kit from Artie Mays and it's called Shabby Chic and I will link Artie Mays below the journal measures seven and three quarters by five and a half it has one signature and it has 76 pages front and back and it will be listed in my shop and there is a 10% discount at the moment until Sunday the 16th of December and I'll put the code below if you're interested as that will be the link to my shop so it's a soft cover but it's a cardstock uh, there's a few layers of cardstock to make it nice and durable. It's covered with this lovely lace <clears throat> and then on the front cover we have this crocheted trim. Uh, this image I believe was um, Pinterest or Etsy, I really can't remember now. And it's been layered onto some cardstock and then some cheesecloth behind. I made a fabric ruffle and then put this pearl trim on there and then there's just some bling here. We have eyelets and organza ribbon as a closure. We have bead dangles and um, these little tabs which was a crocheted trim and I just uh, cut some of it off to make the tabs. So let me make sure I'm in frame. <clears throat> so front cover here we just have an envelope you can put things inside there and we have two tags tag from the kit and a handmade tag so that just pops in there wasn't quite sure whether I was going to put pockets on the inside of the cover but I did um, this comes with the kit as well and the pages are really pretty <clears throat> excuse me uh, here is a pocket and inside the pocket is a journaling card, a double journaling card. And this is also a tuck, so when this is closed, you can tuck things inside there as well. Um, let me just put that back in there. Oops. And we have oops, a tag from the kit. And that's just topped with some... Um, crocheted material and this is from dreams etc I just had that already printed out I keep wobbling the camera sorry um, I need to find a better um, tripod because this is one of the bendy ones so you can bend it into place and someone has said to me the other day about attaching it to something else I don't have anything else around me to attach it to apart from the surface and I've probably just wobbled the camera again so yeah I kind of need something else I think so anyway paper bag uh, some music paper we've got a tuck here with this lovely image again that's from Marty Mays and this is from dreams etc I had some scrap pieces left over so I just done a little double tag there where you can journal on. A mason jar from the kit. Some edge punching. The tab here is layered with cheesecloth, some snippet piece of um, crocheted material and then some bling and on there we have bead dangle. Here is an envelope. My hands are really cold. Oh tag behind the envelope. That is the envelope. There's nothing in it because this is getting ever so chunky. So I kind of had to stop filling it. And here we just have another tag from Dreams Etc. A nice page here that you can do a little journaling on as well and it's 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 still decorated nicely but still journaling room. <clears throat> here we just have some journaling cards all from the kit and I just made a side tuck here we have a doily uh, made a fabric ruffle added some bling another page from the kit made a pocket <clears throat> and this was from the kit as well and we have a tag Oops. this is actually from 
the sweet rose kit. <coughs> um, but I thought it kind of looked shabby chic, so I printed that out and I just glued that onto this folded piece of paper so you can journal on there. We have a tag and another double journaling card here. Another pocket. The hearts are from the kits and I just use that as a tab. Here we just have another pocket there with a tag and a little tag from the kit. Another tab here with a bead dangle. Another page from the kit. Again, another good journaling page. We have a pocket here with a tag from the kit. A little dinky tag from the kit. And I just made a little booklet. There's another one of these somewhere in the journal. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I have done some stenciling. Centre of signature. We have another pocket with another tag from the kit. A little tag from the kit. And that's the other little booklet. You can do some journaling in there. Uh, here is just a floating pocket and it's just a coffee dyed window envelope which I've uh, stenciled up. Put some paper here and then two layers of trim. Inside there we have this journaling card and a large tag. And then there is another one of these um, double tags that you can journal on. There is a little piece of ephemera. There is a dress form and a matching tag. And like I said, you can glue that in or you can move it around as you wish. <clears throat> Oops, probably glued that down, yes. Uh, just some stenciling on here and I used another one of the hearts just as a little tab there paper bag with this image that I just popped on there. We have a pocket here with this lovely image. She looks like she's got a headache or she's thinking. <laughs> um, and then this image here. I thought it was really pretty with the pink roses um, because the paper behind is got pink flowers on it. <clears throat> Another fabric ruffle here with some bling, another side tuck here and we have this image here of this lady and another one of these, just a, a flip out so you can do lots of journaling on that and that just pops in there. Another envelope attached here and a tag and that's from dreams etc and well the envelope is just an envelope <laughs> um, like that the other tab there with um, some layering <clears throat> and a bead dangle another I'll glue that down as well do you know what? I didn't even put the glue anywhere near the edge. <laughs> I still managed to. I might have to go over that a little bit. Yeah, I'll have to go over that with um, some distress ink. So that little heart there. We have another pocket here with the tag. The pocket. And an envelope here with a journaling card inside and that is the journal this is the oh gosh I've glued everything down today <clears throat> where's my thingy bobber <clears throat> here we go I've just actually glued them on <laughs> um, we've got the pocket here it says fly away 
we have this tag and this big tag here. So that is the journal. It does look quite nice. I like looking at it. I think I've said that before. I like looking sideways at, at journals when they're quite chunky. It's just you see all the different um, layerings that goes on. <laughs> anyway, like I said, um, this will be listed in my shop. There is 10% discount. The code will be below. I will also link Artie Mays and you can go over and check out her um, digital kits and ephemera and if her website has got some freebies on there as well so go and check them out um, if you have any questions just ask and thanks for watching bye